Hi Cobdy! How's it going? So, I'm gonna have to admit, when I set out to build a Beetleweight, I've had a couple of problems. Meaning, what's way to put it? I'm indecisive. Because I have went through three different sort of ideas, tried to make them work, and not really worked, essentially. I'll explain what happened. So originally I was planning to rebuild synthesis with the axe. Unfortunately I realised that the extra weight using two motors for the axe was going to be was going to leave me very overweight. So that idea was unfortunately scrapped. My second idea was to make a beetle weight of my ant weight petrify, but I didn't really design it, kind of went with the flow and it was going to be completely overweight without even putting the electronics in. I did try to make a simple four-wheeled rambot, just something straightforward, but at least this time I did plan it, but after getting the materials I realised that I had made everything a little too heavy, things weren't going to work, and eventually that idea was scrapped. And then we come to today. And I haven't exactly filmed an awful lot of this because, like before, I start something, I change my mind halfway through, and yeah, you know, you know what, like. This time, however, I've actually got something to show. So this is still a work in progress. It's just a simple lift up. This one was actually planned on the computer, and then sort of workshop a little bit. These extra fins were added on just to help it self-right, which it can't do. And this titanium plate on the front should actually help for a bit of protection and also to get underneath things a little bit more easier. But during testing I have seen that the servo, which is currently held together with a tie wrap, is not the best. So, <laughs> my plan is to make a piece where the servo can actually sit comfortably inside, locked onto the base plate and the back, and with that, should hopefully be able to give this thing a proper lift. So, straight from the paint booth that's been drying for a few days, uh, only thing really left to do is uh, to assemble it. So, let's assemble. So, so, robot elevated. Safety link in. Right. Oh, that's very good. And that, I believe is a success. And finally, after about six, seven months of saying I'm going to make this beetle, I have made the beetle. And, oh, oh geez. I really need to stop procrastinating. So glad that it's finally finished. But, I still need to give this thing a test run.
little test. I, I'm happy. It's um, my first time trying to make a beetle weight lifter, so obviously things are going to be a little bit sketchy. And there are many things I can do to sort of fix it up, but at the minute this is the f this is fine for its first iteration. I've already got ideas for a version 2 in the works, but let's put a pin in that for now and just keep this as it is. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this. Thanks very much for checking it out. If you want to see some other things that I've built, including some other robots like Beetleweights and Antweights, I'll leave a link up there. And if you want to subscribe to see what I've got coming next, including my next big project, I'll leave a link just there. So that's it for this one. Thanks very much, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Just need to see uh, if I can find somebody to fight with.